A capacity crowd filled the Claude Robillard Sports Complex in Montreal on Saturday night as the Mixed Fight League brought fight fans a spectacular night of combat. In the main event, David the Crow Loazzo stepped into the cage for the first time in almost a year when he faced late replacement Chester Post. Loazzo dominated from the opening horn, controlling both the stand-up and ground portion of the bout. The Zahabi MMA fighter was just too experienced for Post, who was clearly outmatched. The fight ended late in the first, as Post was forced to tap out due to strikes. Loazzo was confident going into the bout, but was aware he would have to deal with ring rust. It was a lot of ring rust. I'm happy I got it, you know, got it over with in the first, and uh, yeah, that's it, man. I'm just, I'm very happy with the performance. In the night's co-feature, 6-1 Steve Bosse squared off against battle-tested Marvin Eastman and Bosse's toughest challenge to date. Bosse showcased improved takedown defense against the more experienced Eastman, stuffing a number of shots. The fighters exchanged standing, but it was Bosse who came out on top, scoring in the process. After three exhausting rounds, the judges award the bout in favor of the hometown fighter Steve Bosse on scores of 30-27 across the board. Excited about the win, Bosse ensured to prepare for Eastman's explosive takedowns. Uh, I work a lot in the gym to my defense to take down and it's good now. Ultimate Fighter Season 2 alum Tom Murphy hoped to keep his undefeated streak alive when he met French Muay Thai fighter Bruno Hosier. Murphy wanted to keep the fight standing, but ended up reverting back to his root style, taking the menacing looking Hosier to the canvas. He controlled from the top position, and with very little time left into the opening round, the referee stepped in, giving Murphy the TKO win. Murphy feels support is what helped him emerge victorious. You know, I came to Montreal about four years ago after the UFC 58 fight. From across the room, like a laser beam for us, sees me, he comes over, and I don't know who he was. He was in Icho's corner at UFC 58. And um, he said, don't worry, I know who you are. He said, you're welcome here. In the fight of the night, Martin Grandma scrapped it out with Sebastian Gargier in a knockdown drag him out brawl. Gargier landed some big shots, which forced the ringside doctor to inspect, but the battle continued. Feeling a sense of urgency, Grandma came out swinging, relentless in his attack, the pressure too much, and the referee stopped the bout, giving Grandma the TKO victory. Bloody Grandma was desperate, knowing the fight was in danger of being stopped by the ringside physician. I knew I was hurt, like uh, looking at him, and he was like better face than, than mine, and, and then uh, I was, uh, okay, let's go till the end.